I didn't spend too much time on watching video in the past week. I spent no more than an hour and a half each day on which watching videos. I only watch certain types of videos. These types are games, TV drama, and a variety show. Also, I often use a music video platform named TikTok in the past week. It is a user-generated media music video platform, and it contains all kinds of videos. I watch these types of video mainly for fun and to release my pressure. For example, I watch games video because it is related to my hobby. The kind of TV drama I watch is not the drama that needs the audience to use their brain to process the information too much, such as the detective drama. I chose to watch those TV dramas that I can even know what is going on, even though I was not concentrated. In the past week, I watch videos mainly on TikTok or on social media in the morning. I usually have classes, and I would love to deal with some work in the morning, so I can only use the spare time, such as the time I brush my teeth or the time I wait for Chen to watch video. Videos on TikTok or on social media usually last no more than 15 minutes, which can exactly fill in my spare time. In the evening, I just want to have fun and relax, so I'm willing to spend much more time on videos. I chose to watch the variety show and TV drama mainly in the evening in the past week, which usually takes up around one hour. The two main devices for me to watch videos are mobile phones and laptop. I watch most of the videos on my phone because it is portable, and the size is much smaller than laptop, so I can have access to mobile phones anytime and anywhere. For example, when I was waiting for train or ride on the transportation, I can directly take out my mobile phones and watch a short video on it to kill time. I also use laptop to watch videos. Compared to mobile phones, the screen of the laptop is bigger, so it can provide me with better image resolution and better quality of sound. Also, laptop is a good tool for me to work as well as to escape from work. I do most of my work on laptop, so when I get tired, I just open a new video website page and watch it on my laptop. Laptop and mobile phones are the only two devices I have in America so far, so I don't have any other choices such as television to watch videos. However, even though I have TV, I might not choose TV to watch videos. I have a lot of work to do, so I'm not available to spend a lot of time watching videos. Therefore, I try to watch the videos to fulfill my needs within the limited time. For TV, I cannot totally control what I watch. However, I can decide what I'm going to watch on my laptop and mobile phones. Therefore, mobile phones and laptop are good options for me to release my pressure or have fun within the limited time. However, watching videos only through laptop and mobile phone also influence my way of thinking and my mindset. Because I don't watch the video that I should watch, but I watch the video that I want to watch. Before I came to America, I watched TV at home. At that time, I also watched something that I was not very interesting or I don't agree with, such as news. But I only search and watch videos that I would love to watch in the past week. Even though in the social media or in the TikTok, where I don't intentionally search for videos, I watch the videos that in compliance with my interests and opinions. The people I follow on my social media are those whose opinions I agree with, or who share the same hobby with me. So the videos shared by them also lie in my interest and my acceptance circle. If someone send out some videos which contain the opinion that I do not agree with. I might just stop following them. In the music platform TikTok, I don't follow anyone, but the app will recommend the videos to me according to my cookies record, such as my likes in the past. Moreover, I like checking the comments of the videos I watch on social media and TikTok, not only because many funny comments exist there. But also because I want to check if the comments on the video are similar to my own opinions.
If I find similar opinions, I will have a feeling of satisfaction and relief. In fact, my mindset and way of thinking is influenced by this way of video consumption, which biases my opinions and make me become more stick to my own opinion. In addition, as I mainly watch videos for fun and to release my pressure, I choose those entertaining videos and avoid the videos that has some in-depth thinking or serious subject, such as news in the last week. In this way, I'm not aware of something happening in the world and might not have critical thinking towards some social events. Therefore, in the future, I may try to download some news app, watch some videos that lie outside my interests. I may try not only watch the video that I want to watch, but also the video that I should watch.